This is Tara from Simple Day, and I am on a mission to make productivity simple using Monday.com. I wanted to show you something called an item default value. And what that means is that every time I create a task, that item is always going to have the same thing. So let's just say if I have um, a task create document, right? And I want that the status column is always going to say not started. So instead of every time I create a task having to do that, I can set calling the set something called the item default value. Now it is true that you can make an automation for this, but sometimes you don't want an automation because let's say you're limited on your number of automation. So what I do is I click on these three dots here and this pen that says item default values, I click on it. And here I'm just gonna save the status to not started. And then I hit save changes. So what's gonna happen as soon as this loads, We'll give it one more second. And you see that there's a whole bunch that you can do. Like you can have a date, you can always have a client, um, whatever file, whatever columns you have in your board, you can set with the item default value. So what's gonna happen if I have another task, let's say create doc number two, just so we can track it. So I created this new line item. And in a second, when it loads, you'll see that it is going to automatically set the status as not started. See, and I didn't have to use an automation. And you can tell that you have an item default value because this is gonna be highlighted. And if you open it, you can see that that is highlighted. The reason it just disappeared was because I had a filter on this. I'm using this on a filter. I hope that this was helpful. If you enjoyed this video, like it below and remember to subscribe if you wanna get more tips and tricks on how to use monday.com.